Okay, I don't know what the fuck happened. Let me move this shit up. I don't know what the fuck happened. I think I clicked something and um, and then stopped the video. Now, th I, I will make this a part two. This is Fortnite Review Part 2. My thoughts and reactions. Now, as I was saying about the Christmas DLC, that's where we left off at. As I was saying about the Christmas DLC, um, to make it not so try hard or OP, having the word you can see their footprints in the snow, you know, that'll make it more easier. But I'm, I was so disappointed that we did not get snow. I hate looking at the fucking lobby backdrop at the snow falling on the ground, knowing damn well we didn't get that shit in the map. It did not feel like a Christmas DLC to me. It just felt like a, a fucking package. Epic Games, tighten the fuck up. Now, I I first, start, first started playing Fortnite towards the end of the Halloween DLC. I want to say I started I started playing Fortnite in November, the beginning of November, or something like that. And I noticed how I had the Halloween backdrop. But there was no Halloween... There was no Halloween fest, festive type shit. You know, like jack lanterns hanging, bats flying. You know, some just being creative. The only thing I remember getting was that jack o' lantern, rock o' lantern, or something like that. But you know, y'all. Okay, look. You know what? I'll make a separate video. I'll make a separate video. Anyway, uh, Christmas DLC. I give that shit a six out of ten because that snow. And all that shit, it would have made it so much more. The snowball rocket launcher wasn't it wasn't that bad, you know. It was I actually kinda liked it. Just to hit the thing say, Wee! Oh! <laughs> I kinda like the uh that fucking rocket launcher. Now um high explosives. There's not really much to say about how explosive so far. That is the one that I like the most. That goddamn high explosives. Oh my god. Just to use the rocket launcher, knowing that you get nothing but rocket launchers, that is so satisfying. I love the high explosive. That's my favorite. Not much to say about it. Just bring it the fuck back. And, um,. Yeah, like bring just go ahead and bring this shit back. I give high explosive nine point five out of ten. Nothing much to say about that. That was the shit. Sneaky, oh my gosh, sneaky fucking silencers. I hated that with the passion, with a passion. I hated that. I don't too much like using pistols, you know. But the submachine guns, I guess that's okay. I don't have much to say. Sneaky silencers are, I mean, I'll be fair. I give sneaky silencers a 7 out of 10, but I was going to give it a 4 because I just didn't like that too much. It, that's not my thing. You know, to each its own. Y'all got your own opinions. I got mine. So don't bash me if I say I didn't like sneaky silencers. Like, girl, you're a fucking asshole. Well, I just didn't like it. It just it wasn't exciting. Like, high explosive. And, uh... What was the recent DLC we got? Or did we get one? I don't know. But I know we got something new coming. They adding in new cities in the spots where you, it's like the middle of nowhere. They adding in new cities and shit. Matter of fact, let me pull up this shit because I got the trailer. Oh, pfft, sorry. <laughs> okay, now let me pull up this trailer uh, on Facebook. <clears throat> I know I saved it. Let me see. Fortnite map update. Yes, okay, here we go. 
Uh, thanks for watching. We really appreciate it. Okay. What are we going to see with the map update? So we've got a map update coming up with a bunch of new points of interest, including mm -hmm. the city, as well as a bunch of new named areas on the west side of the map. We felt that now, let me stop the video right there. This city, it looks awesome. It, you got skyscrapers, you got big ass fucking buildings. So this shit looks good. Like I'm okay. That it was a little bit light on points of interest, so we wanted to kind of even the island out and make it feel like there were more uh, locations to drop into. We've also separated the map into more clearly defined uh, what we call biomes. We've got the bone yard, which is a junkyard. More mountainy, really the different areas of the map. Got a motel. There's also a bunch of additional quality of life improvements. These are work in progress. We're always continuing to make updates to the map. So keep the feedback coming and uh, let us know what you'd like to see us improve. Can we keep the Christmas tree loot after the Christmas event ends? So with the end of the holiday event, we're going to be removing the Christmas trees and the treasure chests that spawn next that to them. That makes sense. This was for two reasons. The first reason is the event is over. The second reason is with all of the additional points of interest on the map update, we've got a lot more treasure chests, a lot more ammo crates, and we wanted to yes. make sure that loot was distributed evenly so that there isn't too much additional rare loot in the map. So we're going to be keeping a close eye on that, and if we need to make adjustments to the treasure chest and ammo spawn rates, we'll be uh, looking at that and doing so. It's possible that we may add more event-specific treasure chests and locations down the road. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. We really appreciate all of your excitement toward... Okay, now... As what I see, I can't show the trailer because I don't want to get copyrighted. I hope I don't get copyrighted for that for using his voice. Matter of fact, I'm putting in the disclaimer: I don't own the rights to his voice. I only own the rights to mine. Now, in that video, you saw uh, we saw a city, or it looks like city hall, or a New York type, a small New York type thing. We got skyscrapers, big ass buildings, a clock tower. You saw the motel. <laughs> Hopefully, you got it's a big motel with many rooms, many loot. You know, you got bone yard, which is the junkyard. Like this shit looks cool as fuck. It's gonna be when this shit comes out. A lot of people are going to go to the new places. So the old places like Pleasant Park, uh, Tomato Town, Dusty Depot, Moisty Meyer, which is my favorite. I love Moisty Meyer. Uh, all of those is is gonna have less attention attention on it. Most of the attention is gonna be on the new shit. So while everybody's still going to the new shit, that gives the sneaky smart players like me the advantage because we're gonna still keep going to the old places, gathering up on shit to fuck you up with. So I'm telling you, this update is looking promising as fuck. I'm loving it. I can't wait for it. You know these new locations is gonna spice this shit up a lot. There may be different types of, there may be some new weapons coming. Who knows? But I will be keeping up with this shit. It's going to drop within the next week or two. When this shit drops, I will drop a review on it. I will drop a review on something that might come too. That's why I said I'll make a separate video for that shit. And fucking Epic Games, y'all better tighten up with this shit. If y'all going to add the shit in the backdrop lobby area, put the shit on the map. Like we could have, we could have so enjoyed the snow. We could have enjoyed the snow so much. Like, come on. But yo, uh, I don't think I don't. I think that's all on this video. This was part two because the first video got cut for some reason. I think I clicked stop. I'm pissed. But yo, y'all got the second part to this video. There's not much, you know. Epic Games, keep doing what y'all doing. Y'all got a great game. It is great. Awesome. Like, keep just keep doing what you're doing. And, you know, and let, make sure you make, make sure you listen to your community. Because that is, that is the most important thing, you know. Like I said in my other video, I'm going to make sure I listen to y'all as much as possible. We engage and, you know, we're going to make this thing popping. So, without being said. I give all those, you know, all together, Fortnite is still a good nine. Fortnite is an awesome game, you know, still in the works, still in the making. So, you know, well, still in the works and making to progress it, you know, let's just say that. So, 
keep doing what you're doing. That is my, that is at the end of this review, my thoughts and reactions. And there you go. This is a, this has been a recording from yours truly. If this was your first time tuning in to your boy, I want you to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and click that little bell because every time I do a video, you will get a notification. It has been Goober765. Until next time.